what you are is God's gift to you. And he smiles. But what we become is our gift to him. I have seen a lot of gifts through uh, Rising Church. And um, not only do I see it through faces, but I've seen it through life. You know, Rising's gone through as the world has gone through COVID. But a gift that I've really seen is that the church, Rising has stepped up and made sure that people are cared for, make sure that people are, are, are called or sent letters, are, are fed, are doing well. And that's a gift. And I believe this gift that we all are able to receive is for the good of the church. This gift is a manifestation of God's Holy Spirit in our life that supernaturally empowers us to serve as a member of the body of Christ. I really believe it's doing something outside of our, of our normal, of our human capacity. It's something that only He can give us. So no matter what your gift is, God has given you something that belongs to the body of Christ. So no one can say, I don't belong. The Bible says, but now God has placed all the parts, each one of them in the body just as he wanted. And I think that's the coolest thing. And especially when I think about Rising Church, I think about the fact that he gives us everything that we need to be a full body. So we all impact the whole body because if there's not one of us playing their part, it can impact the whole. So, you know, there may be a time that you feel like you're a small part, but every part has a part to play. And I know we live in such a busy, hectic world where we feel like we just gotta keep going, we gotta keep going. And we sometimes just don't stop down, stop to have that conversation. Sometimes just sitting to say, God, thank you for all you're doing for me. Speak to me, show me exactly what you want me to be doing. Show me what gift you want me to be sharing with others. You know, our spiritual gifts are intended to be lived out and they're being lived out so that they can help people. So with that being said, you know, you may be wondering what your spiritual gift is. Well, here's the coolest part that we can do. We can ask others, Sister Pat, how you doing? It's good to see you today. What do you see shining through me? And when we ask others, they can be like, you know what, Brandon, I saw you serving the other day. We gotta open it up. We gotta use it. We gotta get out and show it off. And when we show it off, others are blessed and they get excited and they enjoy what God is doing. So we have to serve. A couple words that have touched me all week that God has continued to say, as he said, what you are is God's gift to you. What you become is your gift to God.